And hello my lovelies, it is Tori the Hope Dealer and welcome back to my channel, Guided Intuition. I am here with your daily guidance on this beautiful Monday, okay? July the 9th, however, whenever you see this video, this is when it's meant to resonate, okay? As we know, there are no timelines in the spirit realm, okay? So whenever you see this, this is when it's meant for you. Whew. With that being said, my lovelies, um, I have a message that is dear to my heart dear to my heart before we even get in the daily guidance there was an additional message that i got from you for you guys and myself when i was in the midst of meditating and grounding myself so with that being said i hope that you have grounded yourself this morning i hope that you have meditated i hope that you said those affirmations concerning you and your life i hope that you looked in that mirror today and told yourself how amazing you are if you don't do it any other day i definitely need you to pause stop this video and find a mirror, find your camera, turn it around and look at yourself and really pour that love into yourself because there is this, as you can see from this title, um, in a sense of you comparing where you are, who you are, how far you are, you know, this whole little thing. No, 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 no. I need you to stop right now and thank yourself in this moment. Appreciate the woman or the man you are in this moment. Thank the one that you were in the past and, you know, give give thanks for the one you're going to be in the future. But in this moment, I honestly want you to just love on yourself. Congratulate yourself. I looked in that mirror today and told myself, I love you, Latoria. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of your self-control, your discipline. Even when things, you know, try to come up, come at you, 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 the way that you bounce back is just, I'm in awe of you. I'm so proud of you, girl. And we honestly have to have those talks with ourselves because life happens. Life is happening. Life is happening. Okay. <laughs> and, um, I am all about positive vibrations. I'm all about positivity. I believe what you surround yourself around is what you're going to get more of. Definitely, definitely, definitely. However, we came down here agreeing to contrast. Contrast is the shit that happens in your life that, um, you know, make you evaluate certain things. And my best friend, which is Aries, love her, says something so vital today. You know, sometimes we just try to run away from our past or run away from the person that we were. But you know what? I, I think that girl that was 368 pounds, and 38 pounds, and that ate a whole pan of lasagna and just really took whatever any, what life was giving her, didn't ask for anything. Because because of her and where she was, it made me dig deeper in myself and find out who I really am. So I think that girl. And I think sometimes, we you know, we just try to throw, you know, that person away and we don't like to acknowledge everything but today take the time think yourself at every stage of your life because every stage of my life the past the present and the future without either of them I wouldn't be who I am today or be who I am becoming so don't beat yourself up about past mistakes thank that person you needed that contrast to figure out where you are currently right now and if you don't like where you are currently right now my lovely it's okay that's the beautiful thing. I love, I love tomorrows because it's a new day. It's a new beginning. God gives you enough mercy and manner for one day. He doesn't, you know, you're not supposed to figure everything out today. No. So I want you to take the time to congratulate yourself in every stage of your life. Every stage. And in those moments that we go to try to pick ourselves apart, no, none of that, <laughs> okay? None of that, none of that, none of that. I want you to recognize yourself in every stage, okay? You know, no, it all didn't glitter. It all wasn't gold. It all wasn't sweet. But guess what? Imagine you're the cre you are the creator of your reality, okay? You are a creator. You came down here to create stuff, whether it's, in, whether it's in a career, it's in a relationship, it's in yourself. You came down here to be an expression of love and create stuff. So yeah, it all it wasn't all glitter, but guess what? You have the imagination 
and the skills to create whatever life you want. So if you can't give praise for that, if any other thing, give praise for that today. Be, you know, write 10 things that you're grateful for concerning where you're going or where you came from today. Can you do that for me, my lovelies? <laughs> definitely, definitely, definitely. Okay, I'm not going to take too much of your time because I know that I went in this morning, but I just really felt that like someone is like beating their self up. They're comparing their self to others and what they see on Instagram and what they see on different things. And you're not by yourself. You get what I'm saying? I used to do that. Shit. I did that. What was that yesterday? You know, but you see, I love how the universe works. You know how much, you, how much growth you can get? You know, let's be honest. You know, so I just really want someone to know that um, comparison is a thief of self. You are right where you need to be right in this moment to get the lesson that is going to change your life in ways you can never imagine. OK, so don't just get through it, but be happy for everything that happens in your life. I'm happy for everything. I'm happy for everything. And I can't stress that to y'all enough because that person that. Whatever she was going through is what molded me into the woman I am today. And that is continue to mold me into the woman that I'm going to be in the future. So I give thanks for that. Okay. <laughs> so with that being said, after that long intro, my lovelies, <laughs> um, I'm going to go ahead and give you the guidance, the energy for today. Okay. Let's go ahead and turn these cards around. And, you know, don't be surprised because, um, what this full moon, you know, did is bring up some emotions, some things that um, we had buried deep within us, okay? And it's bringing it up so we can look at it, evaluate, deal with what needs to be dealt with. So when you reach a certain level, you're not still dealing with these, you know... You, you know, you have to pan these things out. You got you to gotta cleanse them. You got to cleanse them out of you. <laughs> so don't be surprised if you're like, what the hell is going on? There's this guy that I love. I'm going to link it. Um, he deals with, you know, um, if you're newly awakened. I forget his name, but he's fucking phenomenal. I love him. Um, and he really helps you how to deal with, you know, just like when you're newly woke or whatever you want to call it. I don't know when you, when you really just hit spiritual, a spirituality awakening. Okay. That's what I'm going to call it. He really helps you how to pan and deal with it. And if you realize that some of these old things are coming up, um, he explains that like on a whole nother level. So I'm going to link it below. So you guys can really like, you know, go later on in your day and just, you know, Put your mind at ease some, okay? <laughs> so the daily guidance for today, okay? The energy for the day, okay? We know that we have been exchanging out old things to receive the new, okay? And I have a message for today that I feel as though if it's not moving as fast as you would want it to move, okay? Or you're not seeing it right now. I'm, I'm definitely seeing it, but it, in some areas, I'm like, okay, what's going on? However, understand you're being guided to take a to, to ha take a breath today, okay? I need you to breathe, okay? I need you to understand that everything that you needed to do, what you needed to surrender, you did it. I don't care what it looks like. I'm going to need you to go spiritual today, okay? Not in the natural eye. Understand, breathe, give it time. Okay? Because it's done. It's done. It's done. I don't care what it looks like. It's done. So I feel like that's a message that somebody needed today. Okay. You, um, you exchanged it. You gave up that living belief. You let go of that relationship. You left that job, whatever it is, you know, in your heart, what you exchanged in order to get, you know, that new thing, you know, the thing, the desires of your heart, you know what it is. All right. So spirit is just telling you to breathe. Okay. Just breathe and wait. It's coming. It's coming. Patience. Just know that it's done. Release it. You don't have to hold on to it because, you know, you've done your part. Let the universe do theirs. OK, so I feel like that's a strong message for today. And also, um, um, I'm hearing a message of we have to the sea. And this talks about going with the flow. I don't care if you can't physically see it, but what you just did, you shifted your reality for the better. But nonetheless, you shifted it. And I'm talking about you, you, you know, <laughs> listen, 
you have a change in the wind and it talks about, you know, going something being uncomfortable. So I feel like this transition for you was uncomfortable. Whatever you had to give up, it was very uncomfortable. But spirit is just saying to go with the flow, go with the flow. Don't don't second guess yourself. Don't beat yourself up. No, go with the flow. It's not about you are not conditioned to someone else's timeline. This is your life. OK, <laughs> with both of these scenarios. Listen, you know, I feel as though just go with the flow. You're transitioning. For some of you already transitioning, for some of you literally between worlds. You're transitioning. So this is why you feel this, 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 you know, like, <laughs> I don't want to say chaos, but, you know, in a sense, we, we might be back. We might be acting like drama kings and drama queens, but that chaos that, you know, what the hell is going on because you're shifting your world, you're shifting your reality, whatever you gave up, whatever you surrendered. OK, this is the stage that you're in for today. So spirit just wants to I feel like spirit wants to explain to you guys what is exactly going on just to put your mind at peace and go with the flow. Continue to go on this path. You don't have you don't need to do anything else but continue to go on this path. Continue to listen to your intuition. If your intuition is telling you something, do it. If it's telling you to read a book, go do it. If it's telling you to go jog, go do it. If it's telling you to write down 20 things you're grateful for, go do it. If it's telling you to meditate, please go do it. This is not the time to sit and let procrastination or self-doubt take over. Listen to your intuition. Let your intuition guide you. Okay? And even in right over here, you have unfinished symphony, okay? Listen, you've done what you need to do. You just continue to let your intuition guide you. The rest is up to the universe, okay? It's up to the universe, the milk and honey. You've done your part. You surrendered. You've willingly, you're going with the flow, okay? Just let the milk and honey flow in. You continue to be the observer, but in a sense of continue to listen to your intuition. Continue to pick up the signs and the wonders that the universe is giving you. Continue on this path. Yeah, I feel like honestly that's the message for today. Now I am going to um, pick you guys a card from the nurse the energy nurse, angel messages. This is the woman that I'm always talking about. I'm reading her book. I I feel guided to um, pull you guys a message, a, a, fo a focus point today, okay? All right, and then I already fell. All right. Okay, so you have two <laughs> that want to come out, okay? So the first one is right here. I want you guys to keep this at the forefront of your mind today. Quiet yourself to hear your inner voice. Seems like your world has been very noisy lately because your angels have earplugs on. <laughs> okay, so in a sense, this is a message that somebody needs to meditate so you can quiet. Quiet your surroundings, quiet your thoughts so you can hear your intuition clearly. I love these cards. So if you got to screenshot that, write that down, rely it to your, you know, re-say it to yourself. What do you, what do you get from that? What is that invoking you? When I first read that, what feeling did it bring in you? Okay. And the next one we have is here. You are engaged, perhaps not the romantic way. However, you are engaged in life. This is, this is in the light of love from universe. Your solar plex is stronger than you think. And in the midst of regaining your power with energy, don't you love that? Did I read that right, guys? I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> it's stronger than, than you think. And in the midst of regaining your power with energy, don't you love that? So again, the power is in you. Everything that you need, everything that you require to f do whatever you feel like is unfinished, it's in you. That's why Spirit is saying, don't worry about it. You've done all that you need to do. You're truly on the right path. You don't have to second guess yourself. You don't have to beat yourself up. I'm leaving this here for you guys so you guys can read that because I don't have my glasses and it's like really blurry. <laughs> oh my God. 
okay. You know, I should have just put them on before I did the reading. But whatever. <laughs> but yeah, you know, don't beat yourself up. Your solar plex is stronger than you think and in the midst of regaining your power with energy. Come on. You're regaining your power from energy. I just love that because I've really been working with my solar plex. I don't know if anybody else, but you need to, whatever your intuition is telling you, do the yoga, do the meditation, work out, get that solar plex of firing burning so you can feel that confidence to tackle and do whatever it is you need to do, my lovelies. So I hope that that was beneficial for you today. I apologize for not reading the card right. I do not have my glasses on, but I love you. My phenomenal lovelies, go out and be great. Go out and take on this day. Set an intent, okay? Set an intent that today will be everything you desire it to be, okay? I love you. And as always, I'm sending my lovely so much love, so much light, and so much peace. And I will catch you in my next video. Bye.